through summertime, fine I let you get on top, I be the underline I'm trying to get beside you like the number nine dime You fine as hell, I guess I met you for a reason Only time can tell hey everybody, this is Wise Man White Here with the Launcher Pro Overview um, tutorial, more like it This is the advanced version I just want to say thanks for subscribing Because that's the only way you would have got this link <laughs> Alright, so What I'm going to teach you right now is how to change Personalize Launcher Pro to how you want it to do. So let's say um, I'm gonna change my background just to a normal a, a black wallpaper. Um, signage. Um, that'll work. It's a dark background. Okay, so I'll, let, I'll set this back down. So let's say I have this background. And you can't really, let's say I want a dock that matches this bottom drawer of my, uh, that matches my background better. So what you do is you go into your preferences. And you go down to appearance settings. And hit dock background. Now none there's that means you have no uh no dock at the bottom custom is you can set your own which is what we're going to do glass is what i have now froyo is what comes with android 2.2 so what we want to do is go to custom so you hit custom and what custom going to allow you to do is go into your uh your album and you're going to be able to pick what you want so i already have a uh I already have a Launcher Pro thing right here. I call I made what I would recommend is you make two folders in your um, DCIM folder or whatever folder you have for all your pictures, and call one Launcher Pro Docs and call one Launcher Pro Icons. So what I have right now is um, I'll go into my Launcher Pro Docs. So let's say I want to choose a bright one that's going to stand out against a black background. So I'm going to go ahead and choose this green one. So bam, right there, you already changed it. And improve it. Um, well, I guess I didn't hit the green one, but <laughs> it changed. You can see I don't have, I don't have the uh, the glass anymore. I got these other ones. And so it always keeps your same uh, I app icons too. So it doesn't change the icons. But let's say you want to change the icon. Let's say I don't want this, I want this camera to be a different camera. Or I want it to be a different icon. You hold it, go to change icon. And just like, uh, you can either use the Launcher Pro icons that come with it. Which is kind of what these do look like, they're kind of clear. Um, or you can do custom icons. So what you want to do is click custom icon. And again, it'll take you to your library. And like this is this is why I told you to make a folder for icons and one for docs so you can find everything easily. And you just hit that. And these are all the icons I have saved. So here's my other camera icon that I have. Already sized and everything. And you just hit that and then bam. My camera icon has changed. Uh I like the other one better, so I'm gonna actually I'll leave that because I haven't seen that one in a while. But that's how you change that. So you can do every icon like that, and you can change whatever app drawer, um, whatever drawer you want to. You don't have to choose this. So you're probably asking or wondering, where do I get these icons? Where do I get these? Um, where do I get the drawer from? So I'm gonna take you guys there right now.
All right, welcome back. So you got your icons like you like them, right? And you got your dock, the way you like, like the way you have it looking, the way you want to save it. So let's say um, you want to back this up. So let's say either you flash something, or you have your little sister, or brother, or mom, like they change something, and somehow you don't know how they did it, but you want to get it back. It's easy. So before. You give them your phone, <laughs> go to preferences, and go to um, backup home screens and settings. And you hit yes. So what this is going to do, it's going to save um, your current layout, your current um, wallpaper, your current um, dock, your current icons. It's going to save all that. Um, the only thing it won't save is uh, your widgets. It'll have a placeholder, but it won't save the widgets, I don't think. Last time I did, it did install, so I'm not sure. But what it will do is it'll, it'll have your same layout. Everything will be the same. So if you lose something, just restore, and then you just go to Preferences, and you go to um, Restore Backup, and it'll give you everything back just like you had it. All right, so that's one thing. And the very last thing I want to show you guys is the preferences and I want to show you the skins so um, let's go back to home so the skins this is what the default launcher pro agenda calendar which it looks like it um, I mean, it looks good. There's nothing wrong with it. It's transparent. You can still read everything. It's real nice looking. So is the actual calendar. But um, you want to spruce it up a little bit. You want to have your phone different. That's the good thing about Android. You can customize it. So let's go to um, our market. And what you want to do is do a search for, press your search button up there. Let's do a search for Launcher Pro. Um, skins I already searched for as you can see so you hit launcher pro skins now these are the skins that you want um, some you got to pay for some you don't uh, I just went ahead and get got the free ones because there's a good amount of uh, skins shout out to signals 23 man you make some good ass skins so I just want to shout you out real quick um, there yours right there signals 23 so you hit a skin and just like a normal app you install it. Once you install it, um, you might have to restart your phone or you might not. Or you might have to just start restart Launcher Pro. If you just if you just want to restart Launcher Pro, you go into the settings and you just hit uh, restart Launcher Pro. But once you download all the skins that you want, like you can preview them, they'll tell you what they look like. If you just hit more in the actually I'll just show you real fast. Go into the market. If you want to see what this one looks like, you hit um, more to tell you what about it. But let's say like, there's this skin and it gives you a preview. That way you don't have to download it and install it. That's what your bookmark will look like. That's what your calendar will look like. And that's what your agenda will look like. And your friends. Friends slash text messages slash Twitter. That's what it'll look like. So how do you change that? Preferences. And then you want to go down here. Uh, I just want to make a note that this only works in the pro version. So if you don't have the pro version, go ahead and pay a little, I forget what is it, two or three bucks. It's worth it. Go ahead and um, pay for that. And then once you get the pro version, it'll tell you right here, you're running, you're running Launcher Pro Plus. That's how you know you got the paid version. So what you want to do is go to your widget settings. And you want to go to your calendar widget or whatever widget you want to change the skin for. Now, once you have your skins installed, you have a list of skins right here. So, as you see, I have a bunch of signal skin, I have a minimal white. And so, let's say I want to, you saw the earlier version. I'll just show you one again one more time. That's what it looks like right now. I want to change that calendar widget. I want to go to blurps it'll ask you if you want to restart hit yes that way you can apply the skin that's what it's doing right now 
takes a couple seconds, and then bam, it's, it's done. You got your skin, and you can always repeat it. You can always change it back to the default. You can always go and install another skin. Um, so that's what it is. That's how you change the skins. That's how you change your dock. That's how you um, change your bar, your icons also. So that's the advanced version. You guys got to see some stuff that everybody else didn't. Like I said, all they had to do was subscribe. So if you got some friends, tell them to go to the Tech Temple. Subscribe. I'll be doing more of these videos, the advanced ones. I put the uh, basic ones on YouTube. So thanks for your support again. If you guys got any questions, um, email me or leave a link, leave a post in the comments so on my webpage, or leave a um, comment even on YouTube. I'll, I'll respond. I always respond as fast as I can. I'm usually pretty good about one to two days. So thanks again for your support. Hope you guys are enjoying your Launcher Pro as much as I am. This is uh, Wise Man White at the Tech Temple. Baby, you win a time cold. The night is still young. Drink that dinner wine slow. I'm trying to make the goosebumps on your inner thigh show. I let you beat me there as far as finish lines go. Yeah, and if you gotta leave for work, I'll be right here in the same bed that you left me in.